All right. All right. Let me see. Looks like we're live. Hey, H7. <clears throat> How are you doing? Open up the blinds a little. See if that'll help the, yeah, the lighting pretty good. So what we're going to do today is we're going to do some swipes, all different variety of swipes. So how are you guys doing? How was your weekend? How are you doing, H7? I saw that it said two people waiting. Uh, now that I've scheduled the lives ahead of time, I can see that there's people waiting. So I went ahead and went live early. I saw that it said that I ran and grabbed some water and then come back and just went ahead and went live. A couple minutes early, but no big deal. So right now what I'm doing is I'm just trying to clean off a palette knife real quick because we're going to be doing a bunch of those, a bunch of swipes. So we're going to do like some whimsy swipes. We're going to do some like a central swipe, a full swipe, a couple of different ones. to grab some paper too okay so the first one this first one maybe we'll do a whimsy swipe how you doing so how's it going where you guys everyone else is at all right I think it would be fun to do, so this is an old paint pour, and I'm just going to pour right over the top of it. And this has some nice little areas, but it's just kind of boring overall. I guess I say that quite a bit. So here's the same uh, cascade, and then we're going to get some teal as well. And I have some fun different metallics mixed up as well. I have a really pretty... Um, what even is this? It's called antique copper. So I think some antique copper with this color would look nice. So what are you guys up to today? Yes, yes. I want to do a whole, there's so many, I have notebooks and notebooks and sketch pads filled out of different, um, I have a whole series of space and astronomical stuff I want to do. I have a whole underwater series I want to do. I have a whole floral series I want to do. I have so many. But yeah, definitely. They definitely have some awesome galaxy colors and shapes. And oh, definitely for sure. Hey, artsy fartsy lovers. I just saw your comment. You're not feeling well. Oh, I hope you feel better. That is no fun. So this is Apple Barrel's Warm Buff. It's a nice lighter tan. It kind of has a gray undertone. I like it with the teals. But I'm going to get out this, put one drop of silicone, I'm going to put a drop of silicone in here, and that's antique bronze. So let me give that a little mix up. And this is in some, a neighbor gave me a whole bunch of um, baby food, uh, little plastic baby food containers. They say uh, Gerber on top, but hey, I reuse anything. I'm thankful to have them. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, I can't really talk too much on here about I, what you're talking about, H7, um, because they're demonetizing anybody that mentions it. But I do have a couple questions for you guys, because you guys know I'm in Washington State, and so you know this is kind of ground zero or whatever you might say. Um, do you guys like, are your stores getting shortage on certain stuff? Cause like our stores literally don't have toilet paper. 
There is no toilet paper anywhere. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The top coming from like, yeah, he, um, he checks that, but, um, he had it on the live chat. Something's up with his phone. I think he needs to update, uh, YouTube or something because he checked that. Yeah, I mixed up a whole bunch. You like that bronze? I actually have two different brands of the antique bronze. And one kind of has a redder undertone and one is more kind of a browner. But this copper, the antique copper, uh, this uh, brush metal, I mixed up a whole bunch of new um, metallics. They're super fun. I'm just trying to decide here. What should we do? Grab my towel. No fish, no shrimp, no TP, no paper towels, low water. Okay, yeah. You eat like it's a famine anyways. <laughs> Refer to it as the beer illness. I've also heard people say, um, oh, something, uncle something's coming, and that's what they're calling it, to not get monetized. But um, yeah, so I don't really want to talk too about it, but it's the shortages in this area that really like, whoa, but I mean, we're Washington State. This is where it's happening first right now so far. Kind of just helping the edge real quick. Uh, there's definitely no hand sanitizer, decongestants, uh, soaps, toilet paper. Food is, um, some things are low, but food doesn't seem to be going as fast as all those other things. But, um, our local high school had the basketball championship, state basketball championship this last weekend. And so there's some concerning things that happened during that. There was people positive in our local high school. So that's kind of concerning. So I'm holding the palette knife just real lightly, barely guiding it over. And I didn't like that. So I'm actually going to turn around and go the other way. And the colors with... Um, is the admiral blue, the darker blue, and the bronze. Those are the colors with silicone. Forty-four people under. Well, there's counties. Um, Clackamas County, Oregon, is under a uh, um, uh, state of emergency. And there's, I mean, because right where I live, I live in Southwest Washington, and I literally live on the border of Washington and Oregon. So, um, like, our, our news is Portland news. But, um, well, we had the uh, influenza B in December here at our house. My son got super sick. Um, I'm a couple hours away from, uh, like, Fort Lewis. The uh, base is Fort Lewis, uh, Washington. Or do you mean, like, I'm, I'm, like, super, super close to Portland, Oregon. But I'm in Washington. So what do you guys think of that? I kind of like the streaks of blue as well. You were sick at Christmas too? 
Yeah, every the flu is super bad this year, year too. The flu is terrible bad. But anyways, um, terrible subject. <laughs> I feel bad if anybody, because uh, I mean, I I even at points it's just too much. Uh, it's on every channel, everywhere you go, you know. So anyways, let's talk about. So how are your things drawn? Your um, stuff that you did, Stacy, the uh, whimsy pour and the different things you did the other day on your live stream. That was super fun. So I want to show you guys. Like up in here. Like that corner is so pretty. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yours turned out pretty. Awesome. Good. I'm glad to hear. So I'm just reusing canvases today. So I have this one also. And I really, really like the colors. So we might actually do it in these same colors. But the tricky thing is going to be doing a swipe. Because this is actually, this isn't gold. This is yellow ochre. So to have the purple with that, we're going to try. We're going to work around it. Oh, you might have to do another one, or you might have to talk with H7. He's, li he's liking that one. Awesome. Good. All right. So I think this was a mystery pour. My mystery pours I do on Mondays now, but I think that's how I got such a funky color combination. All right. It sounds like you guys will have to work that one out. <laughs> so, okay. I started to just, because I don't want to do them all whimsy swipes. So what we're going to do on this one, we're going to do a central swipe. So I'm going to go ahead and just flood the canvas with this. It's um, Apple Barrel's Plum Kiss. We're going to flood the canvas with this color. And then I'm going to do a central swipe. That's what I'm going to do. So kind of a difference, show you the difference in swipes. But it's going to be with a palette knife again. Awesome. Mike's just coming home here at the door. Let me just get this spread about and then we'll do, I'm going to do like a swipe just from the center. I thought it was going to be a rainy day, but it looks like the sun might be coming out. All right, so now that we got that spread about, um, let me give it it's quite a few bubbles. I guess I shook the bottle up real quick right before I, one stubborn bubble there. All right, so sunny and 80 there. Oh, sounds nice. So that is, oh, it's, it's not what it says it is. I obviously did, I changed the color because it's not ultramarine blue. <laughs> this one is Deco Arts uh, Red Crimson. I think I want to put a little bit more of that uh, antique copper. I think that would look kind of nice. What's your weather like? H7, what are what are you how what type of weather you got going on? Okay. So, I am going to put just a little bit of the yellow and I think we'll go ahead and put some gold in there too. All right. 
Let me back these up so I got some elbow room. Sorry if I miss anything in chat, really concentrating here. Okay, 60s, mostly sunny, was overcast earlier. Yeah, it was overcast here earlier. It was calling for rain. They said we were going to have, you know, rain. But um, it's beautiful and sunny all of a sudden, so I don't know if it's going to rain or not. And this is just really, really, really lightly running your palette knife across. Well, now I don't know, just as I said that, it seems like the, the sun might have went behind a cloud or something, <laughs> just as I said that. You never know with Northwest weather, it's so unpredictable. I don't knew. I don't like that, but I'll fix it in just a minute. I haven't seen Katie pop in here. I was just chatting with her. I figured she would pop in here. Before I knock over and make a bunch of messes here. All right, lovely lacing. <laughs> well, H7, I do have one coming up um, in April. And that's our big, big, big one that has like 10 to 12,000 people. And it's indoors. I'm a little concerned. So it's, it's not till the end of April. So I'm sure we'll know a lot more towards then. But um, I have just April and May. Some Mother's Day ones, the weekend of Mother's Day and the end of April. And so I'm liking it all, but like right there, I kind of wish it was, I don't know if I should mess with it or just leave it though, you know. I hate when you have spots when you just kind of want to mess with it, but you know you probably shouldn't. <laughs> oh, thank you. You're liking that one? Oh, Beck album cover. I love Beck. I really, really like Beck, but I don't know if I've really seen too many of the um, album, co album covers because I always listen to it on... Um, I haven't, I don't think I've bought a back album. I just always listen to the songs on the, on my phone mainly. <laughs> so, sea change. All right. You loving that? Oh, thank you. Thank you. So we've done a whimsy swipe and we've done a um, central swipe. So now next let's do a, um, full swipe with a piece of paper. So uh, lots of different techniques you can do with a swipe. And then you can do a controlled swipe. And like I've swiped uh, cactuses, seahorses, um, flamingos. So you can do a controlled swipe too. So all right, guys, I am going to set this one aside. But it's got some lovely, lovely lacing with that bronze. All right, I'm gonna grab the next one. But I thought today we could kind of just focus on swipes and just talk about different swipes. So this one, I was torn and whether to pour over it, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and do it. I've hung on to it for a while. This one, I almost took apart to, there's some areas right in here that's got this 
gorgeous gold lacing that I was thinking I can make some jewelry with. But it's a shame to waste the whole canvas for just this area. When I, once I cut it off the frame, it would be, you know, the rest would be useless. Oh, was I? Was it? It probably unfocused when I grabbed the thing. It always does that. All right, so we're going to do a full swipe here. So I am going to randomly put some colors down because I'm going to swipe white over across the top of it. And I'm going to try to make it look kind of, well, you'll see. Because I might balloon smash on the top afterwards is what I'm going to see if we're going to do that. Is Mike got not? Yeah, Mike's on now. Well, come look at this last one. If you want. I peeked at it and I felt like it, I needed to move it. So <laughs> it didn't look um, level all of a sudden. So I'm glad I looked over there. We were just talking, Mike, about shortages in their areas, too, without talking about the actual reason for the shortage. But, um, yeah, they said their areas are starting to show some sort shortages as well. Artsy Fartsy Lover said hers, uh, her area is running out of certain stuff. She's in Florida. I didn't know if it was just a panic because of, you know, Washington State. Or if it was happening all over. So I don't have to put quite as much on this top. I should have. Okay, I want some green. Hey, Foraging Seeker, how are you doing? Welcome. How have you been? Us fellow Washingtonians. I was just talking about what life's like in Washington right now. <laughs> All right, white. I honestly don't have that much white. Ooh, we might have to mix some more. Let's see, do we have white here conveniently? Okay, I'm gonna put just a little bit more white in here, guys, real quick, like. Just the last of this white, so. All right, and that's my cheap paint. That's my favorite, favorite brand. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, a little bit of Floetrol. Then I'm going to get some water in there, and then we'll give it a shaky shake. And then we're going to um, swipe with a piece of paper, just like copy paper. Um, I hope not. I don't know. We'll see. But we're prepared either way. Yeah, the, the stuff at Costco sold out immediately. <laughs> I, we just looked at all of our freeze-dried stuff. We have freeze-dried peas, bananas, strawberries, um, milk. I don't know. We just went through ours yesterday or this morning, actually. All right, just shaking this white one. All right. Um, I'm gonna make sure this is all covered. All right. Stupid focus there. But yeah, they're demonetizing any channels that are talking about it. 
which is just craziness, but so I'm just careful about what I'm saying. Okay, now I'm gonna do a full swipe and we may do a balloon thing on here too. So I've just got, well, I've got more than one piece. I just want one piece. One piece of paper. Get everything back because this is quite the mess when it comes off. Thank you. It's sagging a little. Mike's going to help me with that. Last canvas is um, not level, so he's come to help me real quick. All right, now get that scrap out of there. But this you can use for other stuff too, to collage or whatever. Um, there we go. I know, it is. We just gotta do our best. So focus camera. <laughs> there we go. Let me get a little bit down this way, down this way. It's okay, It's the canvas isn't the best canvas. That's why I was kind of waited to use it. That last one kind of has a little bit saggy canvas. So what I normally do for a saggy canvas, and I did it on that one and it did not do the trick, but you can wet the backside and wait like the next day or when it's all dried, then if you wet the backside of the canvas, it'll um, tighten it up for you. So let me see if I can get a little bit more up through here. So I don't know if I really want a balloon smash on that. I was going to do a balloon smash, but um, I kind of liking it. <laughs> I don't want to mess it up. It's okay. So what do you guys think of this? This has got like green within the red, within the... That's so fun with swipes. That was a whimsy swipe with the copper. Wildly whimsy. Wildly whimsy, Mike says. <laughs> we have, um, I guess, just garlic and chives growing right now, and that's it. <laughs> We don't have much of anything growing right now, but we have everything to get stuff growing. I just haven't done it yet. <laughs> Stinging nettle. Yeah, we have so much all around us, too. Wild stuff. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to get this one moved aside, guys. But crazy sale action on this one. Now we have a 11 by 14. So which of the three swipes would you guys like to see again? Should we, do, hey, come on camera, be nice to me. Let's see, focus on my hand. The other day I had to make it focus on this. It focused on that and then just took it down and it was able to focus. So, do you guys have any, um, which of the three, a whimsy swipe, a central swipe, or a full swipe? Anybody have a um, choice on the, what they would like to see? You have um, all that growing. You have chia grown. That's awesome. I heard super, super, super easy. Uh, we can't do tomatoes yet for this time of year. Oh, and I have mint, but I mean, our mint like practically grows wild. <laughs> uh, so three goats and five chickens. Uh, you know, where we live now, we can't have any sort of animals, but I have property out near my mom's and uh, 
that's what we hope to someday have a bunch of animals out there, but just not right now. Can't right now. Uh, the central swipe, whimsy swipe, or a full swipe. The three that I've done already, I was going to do another one of either any of those three. Obviously, my hands are getting it, but that's okay. No big deal. You want to see another central swipe? Okay, let's do, I'm kind of really wanting to do a turquoise background. So I'm going to do a turquoise background and black and gold swiping, and maybe a purple or one of these um, violets. Diagonal, okay, let's do a diagonal. We can do a diagonal. Of course, I choose the one color that is giving me troubles with not wanting to come out. <laughs> yeah, we can do diagonal, totally. You know what I should have done, but I, I've already got it all the way down, is it would have been fun if I did a diagonal one with like half black and half... Um, or like half black and half turquoise and then central or swipe diagonally through that. I already have it down. But. So I'm thinking some black and some gold and maybe the red violet. I hear Mike in there talking. He must be on the phone now. Got a lot of paint down here. Maybe a little more than I really needed. That's okay. Let me. There we go. And then I just shake, oh, you flung a bunch back there. I didn't mean to. I usually just fling it on the canvas. I kind of aggressively shook it off that time. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, yeah. I um, I wasn't sure if you guys could hear him, but yeah, all of a sudden I heard him talking and we're the only two home. So he must be on the phone if he's talking to someone. <laughs> all right. I think maybe black first. We'll put the black down first. So I put quite a bit because it's going to sink a little bit. And then I think the berry cobbler would look good. And I'm going to get out this... Um, gold here because I'm going to put silicone in it. I don't want silicone in my bottle. So I'm going to put silicone in this gold. And this is the gold I had mixed up for that other one the other day. Just give it a little bit of a mix. All right. Now wipe this off and we'll go. I wonder if I have enough. Yeah, I think we probably have enough paint. You always, I always second guess myself. Do I have enough paint? Whoa, pretty, pretty. Trying to leave kind of some gaps, but it's really hard without getting your freaking finger in there.
Yeah. Um, we haven't had chickens since our chicken coop. Uh, we had chickens out at my mom's house and the chicken coop burnt down. I've told that story a couple times. So um, none since then. <laughs> But I grew up raising goats. I uh, used to show goats in our county fair, Nubians. I had a Nubian named Claire. And Clara actually died because a deer bred with her. And in childbirth, she couldn't, she was having a hard time birthing the half deer, half she was pregnant with. So really weird. She actually died because of that. And she knew me in that I would show at the fair. And as a child, you're like way confused at what's going on because I was probably like 10. But now as an adult, I'm like, oh, OK, how weird. But as a child, I was heartbroken and just confused. So what I kind of want to do here is now kind of because what will happen is these wispies that I'm pulling out will pretty much sink. So you'll just see a little bit later after it. Um, no, the offspring did not survive. Nope. Uh, so, but we did get a, just a look at it. So that's how we knew what happened, but it didn't survive. It didn't breathe. Oh yeah. Get some good compost going for sure. Ah, uh, yeah, we have lots of blackberries around us for sure. Yeah, deer goat, but uh, yeah, it, it happens, but they can't, they can't survive. Like, I guess they'll go to gestation, but they don't actually survive. I kind of want to have them fun with the skewer. But I don't want to overdo it with the skewer. So you can kind of see where it just kind of, barely it kind of ends up sinking when you do it with the skewer oh radish grows fast too okay yeah i'd heard that about chia super super easy and fast i don't i need to i have chia seeds i could uh i have like food chia seeds and i have chia seeds Well, we grew a chia pet, so I guess we did grow some chia. <laughs> so, all right, guys, I have one more. What swipe should we do for one more? Dear God, it's a deer goat. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. You have radish seeds? Yeah. Um, you're even farther north than I am. I mean, we can't start anything in the ground just yet. We are starting our like seeds indoors, but we can't really get anything outside yet. Are you starting things outside already? Maybe in greenhouse or something. Makes nice sprouts in three days. Yeah, I put, I make a lot of smoothies. So I do a lot of chia seed smoothies. So, all right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and move this one, but that one's got all kinds of gold lacing. Um, right up in there is so pretty. 
Yes. All right. One last one. What type of swipe? Six. Uh, I have a hair in that one, that last swipe. I got to get it just a second, guys. Let's get the focus back. I don't know why it wants to do that. Focus on this. And then down, 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 down. Okay, thank you. Yeah, I think I did see a couple more freeze days for us. Okay. This next week, yeah, I think I had seen something like that. What shall we do, guys? Yeah, some potential low level snow. I was, uh, Mike was telling me. Should I do another whimsy swipe? That's what I'm kind of going for, kind of thinking, guys. A whimsy swipe. All right. <laughs> I was thinking some pinks, but some lighter, not like bright pink. Maybe even some gray. Uh, I'm not sure. How about some of this brown color? Because it kind of has a gray undertone. Or get a big old glop of something in there. And I have this really pretty champagne color mixed up that would look so pretty with this. A ghost swipe? Okay, so I don't call it a ghost swipe. What is really the difference between a central swipe and a ghost swipe? I mean, isn't it pretty much the same thing? Hey, Yasmin, how are you doing? So you, you want to see it? This is my last one. I already started it. But next time I do swipes, we will for sure do a ghost swipe. We will start with a ghost swipe. But we just did a um, couple of different central swipes. And that's all I call it. Is there really a diff? I don't know. Is there a difference between a central swipe or a? Because I know the ghost swipe came out more recently, and I just have been doing them for a long time and already calling them central swipe. A gray with a brown undertone. Let me look. My gray has kind of got a bluer undertone. So this is a champagne, a metallic champagne, and I'm going to use that. But the gray I have mixed up is kind of got more of a blue undertone, and I'm kind of going for um, was looking at this uh, brown with the gray undertone, but. All right. You make little ghosts like um, it to actually look like ghosts. That's awesome. You're good. You're doing, you're fine. Oh, awesome. Good, good. Tired, but good. I think that's about all of us. I think we're all about tired, but good. At least for me, that's where I'm at. Oh, amaranth seeds. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
edible foliage as well as seeds. Awesome. Yes. Now, do you get fiddlehead ferns? That should be coming soon. Do you have fiddlehead ferns up there? That's one thing that I have wanted to so bad. And I've never went out and looked for fiddleheads. But I definitely have always wanted to. Yeah, the weeding of them will be a harvesting, yes. Um, I've also grown nasturtium to eat, too. I love nasturtium in a salad. And those are fun because they're so pretty, but then you can eat them. And... Got to get some elbow room here, guys. I'm trying to leave a few areas like this pink and this low so it's not completely swipe. Oh, see, now you guys got me wanting to research a few more things, chia seeds and Yeah. You're not fiddling with it. <laughs> exactly. That exactly. There's, you know, the things that I'm just not sure about. I have so many other things that I am sure about to where I'm just like, eh, it's not, I don't know enough about that right now. But there's so much else out there that I am sure about that I'm just like, okay, no worries. I already know about all these mushrooms and berries then because that's where my I mainly know about mushrooms and berries I really want to learn more about uh, greens some of the local greens we have yeah but with the weather we've had the winter we've had it, I mean it is early for morels but it seems normal because of the weather we've had so all right, guys, this is my last one for the day. I do see a couple air bubbles real quick. But anybody have any questions or loving those colors, guys? Those colors look gorgeous together. That champagne was just the perfect metallic in there. Like right here, I'm not sure if you guys can see that lacing of that metallic through there. So pretty. Thank you. Thank you. But that was my last one for the today. And so Friday, I will be back for live stream. And we will do uh, viewer gets to you guys, everyone in the chat gets to pick the colors on Fridays. So same time 10am Pacific Standard Time. Uh, I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome week, though. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. You guys are all so awesome. Thank you. Thank you. I know Mike needs to. We actually have a couple videos like half made for Mike. We need to make him post them. I know. Hey, Creations by Baby Doll. Hello. I was actually just getting off of here. Thank you so much. This was a whimsy swipe. We did several different swipe techniques today, but um, 
I was actually just getting her off of here. But thank you so much for stopping by. Yes, I'm so sorry. I wish I had another canvas ready to go. I would throw one up there just to do one more, but I don't have any more ready right now. I need to do some priming. That's what I need to do is prime some, can well, not prime, but gesso some canvases, which is priming them. But, oh, thank you, thank you. All right, everyone. It is dreamy, isn't it? It is dreamy. Hey, London Art Nanny. See, everyone's coming in just as I'm taking off. Hello, and how are you? Thank you, thank you. I was actually just getting out of here. Oh, you had to get your phone fixed. Oh, okay. Well, I, I'm, it takes a few minutes for it to process, but I am going to post this video so you guys can see it in the playback, but sorry that you weren't able to see it during the live, but we had lots of fun, and my live streams are Tuesdays and Fridays at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Me too. Always learning and looking for more local edible spots, for sure. There's always so much more to learn. So good luck in all your learning and your foraging and all that foraging seeker. All right, guys, have an awesome, awesome day. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I appreciate you all. And be the change you want to see in the world, everyone. All right, have a good one. And thank you so much.